Hi everyone, this is the Beer Watcher, July 15th, 2016. Hope you're all doing good today. And uh, right now we are looking at Solar System Scope to show and prove beyond any doubt. And then I'm going to use another program called Stellarium to prove that what I'm going to show you is not the moon or any other planet that shouldn't normally be there. So by clicking on this little time, we hit actual time. We hit this little globe here, and then we can go and put the crosshairs in Alaska. The sun is setting in the west in this video that I'm showing you, and that would put the object approximately right about here. Okay, so next, I'm going to show you, this is Stellarium. This is the same thing. You know, at the bottom, you can see this is Anchorage, Alaska. This is going on right now. This video is happening. So here, <coughs> again, the sun is facing in the west. The moon. <coughs> We've got Venus and Mercury over in here in the 10 o'clock position. Venus is nowhere to be found in this object. And the moon and Mars are clear over here. Isn't even see the moon all the way down there on the horizon next to Mars. Okay. Now, let's watch an Alaskan video time frame. So this is Anchorage, Anchor Point West facing the sun. Watch the sunset. You watching this? I go back. I don't think we can get a whole lot clearer than that, people. Look at that. The sun is over here, but whatever light is below it, which is Nemesis, is lighting this thing up as the sun passes us up. See our? Uh, it just doesn't work that way. If that would it be anything other than a planet that isn't supposed to be there, which one? Well, it's not Nibiru. Could be Arboda, or maybe planet Helion, or maybe the one of the other planets. Let's watch this again. And by the way, what moon would possibly finish eclipsing and set before it even... The moon just doesn't eclipse like that as it sets, <laughs> right? Think carefully about it. Let me zoom that in for you a little more, one frame at a time. This is pretty stunning stuff. <laughs> Look at that. You can't, how could you call that a lens flare? <sighs> yeah. Look at that. Please like and share this video. Next, I want to show you. Uh, that's just pretty amazing. Again, this is right where I thought it would be. Right near, her, right near the uh, Orion's Belt, where, it's, where it came back from and where it's going to. And I think it's going to eclipse on you during the Feast of Yom Kippur, mid-October. Wow, the Earth is going through the constellation Aquarius. And then uh, I'd like to show you another thing I captured. So let's look at uh, another video that I captured, Mexican Sunset. Now, while this happened, that happened, that is actually happening now. This happened this morning. I'm going to run this little videotape. By the way, this got deleted. I'll leave a link in the description. See this planet here? Right here at the 7 o'clock position. Perhaps that's planet Helion. Look at the light that thing's refracting. Wow. And, of course, it's got its cloaking device it's refracting from, too, and the rings of light. Right? If you have a... Notice the uh, suspicious rings of light during the sunrise right here. That's part of the cloaking device, by the way. See the rings there? And that's when the sun gets behind that cloaking device and shines it on the cameras. Some people even see that stuff on the garages and floor and uh, on the ground. So, <laughs> wow. And uh, my final thoughts on this whole election process. I'm not wasting my time voting for any president because the whole thing's rigged. And uh, they're working on a civil war. I think it's going to start in Cleveland, Ohio. Ohio. They're hiring people on Craigslist to stage with military background to basically uh, act out the fight. Provocateurs, you might say. So when the election comes right down to it and Donald Trump looks like he's going to win, then... Uh, 
people are going to stage and riot and protest because they don't want to go back where they came from and all the racism that's going on. Ah, don't waste your time going to those. It's uh, it just ain't going to be. Donald Trump's not going to evict anybody. Uh, there's worse things coming than any distracting election riot process. Okay, this is when you're concerned about this incoming object, I think. So the whole thing's a distraction. And as far as I'm concerned, uh, yeah, I'm just not going to bother voting because it ain't going to come down to it. Barack Obama is going to postpone the election before that ever happens because it's all staged. Anyways, please like and share this video. Thank you for watching.